Lane, Max Amer, Will White T, SR WM Ricotta, you saved. SR Sure WM Maz, you saved. I'm PC Shoprite Chunk, so LOL LG GRD A B N R PC. PC and Lakes LA, SR 2% Milk Court, Heavy yeah. Cream, SR Red oh, wow. Pet Hummus, oh, Baezo Maz Sile, Wu Witch Witty, Iberi Code Cheese, FL Bluefish GRA, BRD PKTLS, PETA, Tax Balance, ShopRite, Heights Down, New Jersey. I got a box. The Mancha! Dude, I'm just about to finish this book, and it's pretty good. Was it a medium ride like you anticipated? Thinking back, yeah, I think it is. Because it kind of covers... Uh, it's, uh, to me, it feels like a parallel story to the movie, uh, Blade Runner. Because it's like it, but it's different. I still enjoy Blade Runner better as overall in both median categories because it's just so visually good and, and the story is slightly different and condensed in a way that you don't lose too much so it's it's pretty good even though it's apples and oranges. Gotta get these skis. Oh goody. Let's go. They looked pretty much brand new. I hope they are. And then we're gonna find a box that's really long and put the skis in them and sell them to somebody who cares about skiing. S sell them to enthusiasts. I don't know anything about skiing, but I know these are a good condition item. They're vintage. Those Fiskers? The only thing I saw wrong is this pole's a little bent. But we'll inspect them further once we get Wawa. These skis are going to be sold as is. Found on the side of the road, reputable source. That's how they're going to be sold. Easy pickings. It's like big trash day, you just drive around and you find money on the side of the road. And maybe it's a one step money, maybe it's a two step money. But it's money. And if you know, you're not doing anything else, you might as well do the scoop de loop. This time, I don't know anything about skis, but I'm guessing they're going to sell for resale value, 40 to $60 each. So that's like 120 bucks plus the Xbox E, Xbox 360E that we found. The latest edition Xbox, even broken, those sell for like 25, 30 bucks. So that's like 140, 150. That's a lot of money for just hanging out. Uh, oh, lines. no! This must be held the whole time. I will take no other answer. Also, I must teach you the ways later. Safely in the vehicle.
nice day if you want. Just two regular brothers. Two regular brothers. So much leisure. This is a really nice background. It's okay. Swept the street once. The broom? Yeah. This whole street. <laughs> the whole street. Look how long this street is. He swept this whole street. <laughs> now what everyone's wondering is why did you sweep this whole street? So I could skateboard down the street without doing any stuff. That's a good reason. Make sure the copy is there, sir. I think we can talk about what we do outside. Alright, just close up shop here for a moment. Nothing to see here. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> really? <laughs> Better Mike here, standing at the top of stairs. This is an unusual second story of the Silverman's house episodes. We have here Mike Silverman and Ben Silverman, and we're just kind of hanging out in the stairwell because that's what we plan to do. Now, there's been a few moments recently, Mike, I'm sure you can confirm this, that we have played some StarCraft number one. I confirm it. Yes. See, it's times like this that we have to be extra remembering. StarCraft 1 is still StarCraft 2 divided in half. Your ranger shirt for the class, his ranger shirt, is I'm going to say a 2016. That's true. That's true, folks. It is a 2016 ranger's shirt for the boys camp. Now, just so that we have this on the record, the boys camp and the girls camp got the same t-shirts for their respective ranger trips. Is that so? I believe so. It is so. Alright, so we're going to take a look here quickly at the ranger's font. As you can see, it goes down. It is in a slightly different colour than the 2000, might correct me if I'm wrong, 2015 ranger's shirt. Is that correct? Whatever you say, I'm not sure. He is not sure. Let's find out. Let's see what's in here. And thus, the Powerpuff Girls were born. Let's bring it out to the light. Here we go, folks. Let oh, us, it is a different color. Let us take this a tad closer to the camera. You be the judge. Are these two different colors? My wine glass is out in the shed, mate. We have to go get it. Well, what? Right. Then. See, what we did was we came inside without it. And now we don't have it. And there's some care for Mike, the bungee pits. I'll get you. And now we have to go get the wine glass, which is outside, to the left, inside the shed. This is unseeable. It's like we're playing a video game, dude. Got it. He got what he came for. Mike, I want to let you know, I don't know if it'll be worth anything to you, but at the end of November, I will have a novel. It's fresh toothpicks all around. <laughs> I've been having more toothpicks this year than I've ever had. Oh. Disposable toothpicks. 
Right. So each company, individual critique on the toothpick, right? Some of them would go into design. The toothpick would be splendid in every way, using the best wood, carved expertly. Others would pride themselves in robustness, strange, outlandish woods, wood from different planets, things that were just legendary. Right, and then there'd be the toothpick havers that are like, I call this shit myself, man. <laughs> and that would be the way of the land in my book, man. Right, toothpicks are going to be of the highest etiquette. So people will judge based off what toothpicks they have, whether or not they use them, or when they use them, or how they use them. It's going to be the thing that defines all attributes about a character. The toothpick is destiny. So I'm thinking about it, man. And I'm there, I'm trying to think about my novel, man. And I'm thinking, man, that I can't do this bit two times in a row, man. Because people will think it's funny, man. They're like, man. <laughs> I'm not going to do it again, but I'm going to keep you on the ropes, man. And think that I'm doing it again, man. But I'm not doing it again, man. Definitely not doing that routine again, man. And I'm sitting there, but I'm standing. And I'm like, <laughs> I can't. I'm not gonna do it again. Look, it, it's it's just not what I'm gonna do. I can't do it again. That'd be ridiculous. That'd be an outplay. It's ridiculous, mate. But I just want to let you know that I was sitting there, but I was actually sounding. They <laughs> 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 say you should. Drink wine when you type the story and edit when you're sober. But I'm going to be drinking wine for the whole month and editing the next month. So I'm going to be <laughs> drunk for a month. <laughs> and then edit it. And then that'll be the story. And whatever it is, it is. And I'll make an appendix or whatever if I need to add anything else. Subscribers to this channel are the only people who are going to know the the references that we're making to the story that will actually not be references referred to in the story but afterwards and only then can speculatives believe except for this one would be the true conspiracy and that's the one that would be accepted by popular majority well he is the brother of the guy who makes these videos about this guy who is his brother oh you have it exactly right you nailed it there mike ben and mike and mike and ben Ben and Mike and Mike and Ben. Ben and Mike and Mike and Ben. Ben and Mike and Mike and Ben. <laughs> I've been having more toothpicks than I've had this year than I've had ever. <laughs> I've been having more toothpicks <laughs> this year than I've had ever. <laughs> what is it? I've been having more toothpicks this year than I've had ever. I've been having more toothpicks this year than I've ever had. This is uh, almost finished. This is almost finished. This is a pizza, one of Dad's legendary pizzas. Only a few select souls have been privileged to taste it, and even fewer still could express in words the deep levels of satisfaction they experienced. This is for posterity, right? Right. Okay. I mean, what's posterity ever done for me? Nothing.